I don't have the time. What are we laughing at? No, 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 I'm an artist. <laughs> Apparently, Tommy Fury's in the pool. Should we go and have a nosy? <laughs> Too tired for this world. I shouldn't have born, been born in this world. I should have been born in sleepy world. Mm. So I'm going for a meal with my friends today. I don't really have the time, but um, one of my friends is gonna be going away for ages, and the next time that we'll see is probably Christmas. So make time in your fucking schedule, Jenna. Look at me. I look like. Oh my god, I actually look like Beetlejuice. What is this hair? What is this hair? Um, yeah, so I was stressing out this morning. I was thinking, what look can I do? And I just thought, do you know what? Why don't you just do your fucking editing? Because every day you'd think, oh, she just posts the fucking picture and the video. Takes so fucking long. You would not believe, like, getting the cover photo, finding the right cover photo, and then... Writing the caption, making sure you've tagged everyone, tagged all the makeup. Um, you've edited the picture, you've edited the videos. It looks right on the feed. You post it at the right time. It takes a long time. So instead of having that eat through my day, every day, I'm panicking when I'm in the middle of a makeup to get the makeup look up. I'm gonna edit as many as I can today so they're ready to go. So that way I don't have to stress about being ready for later. And I can take my schnauzer on a big walk that he deserves. I'll be one minute. Oi, oh. oi, who is that? <laughs> <laughs> come on, come on. <laughs> come on, you need to go home, you. Go, go, go. Oh, look how small this little snail baby is. Oh, that's so cute. Jay would love that. Wait, where's it gone? Oh. Hey, up, here we go. I've had glow up casting, message me again. Very flattered, but I nearly died doing that last year. That was the scariest thing. It was so scary. Oh my God. I don't think I want to do that again. I don't think I can do that. I don't work well under pressure. I'm certainly not fast paced. And I don't think I would show my full potential if I ever, if I even managed to get on the shows so hard. I don't think I could do it. And I don't think I should do it. Because... I just don't think I should. I don't think, and sometimes the way I love the show. Sometimes the way that these feet to full. You know, this is my full time job. I've done this on my own. I don't know if I want to be spoken to like I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I don't know. I'll keep it in the back of my mind, but I don't think it's something I want to pursue. Not that I even got on anyway. I didn't even get past. Where did I go past? I had an interview. And then I had another interview. And then I went in for an audition. And then I went, oh fuck. And I had to send off that makeup look. Oh, that was traumatic. <sighs> yeah, it was a lot. I don't think I can do it again. My dad just rang me. I missed it. No, actually I got it and then it didn't go through. So I rang him back, no answer. I go, I text him and say, what's up? And he messages back saying, Please call me whenever it's convenient. And I rang you back and said, what, what's up? What did you want? And he said, oh, I just pressed it by accident. What? You rang me by accident and you couldn't have just said, I rang you by accident. You had, you had to make me call you to say <laughs> that you rang me by accident. He's obviously very bored at his new job. Idiot. Okay, we're going to see Auntie Chloe now, aren't we? And Rosie Posey. Because I thought I might... If I've got editing work to do, I might as well do it with Chloe. She's got a day off. Well, I'm seeing her later anyway, but you can never get too much of Chloe. Yeah, and I feel bad because he, he's not really been with any friends. He's just been on his own with me. No mum, no dad. So I want him to see Rosie and he's see one of his friends. Look at his jumper. <laughs> he fucking hates it, but he keeps shivering all the time. 
Oh, that's a beautiful little star turtleneck. You look so handsome. <laughs> Is that nice? Is it nice? Come on, boys and girls. So, so I love it. doggy daycare. You okay? Oh, buddies. Why has he got his eyes open like some sort of psychopath? Freak. Well, as usual, I'm a complete arsehole. I didn't get any work done. Um, I'm simply irresponsible. I was just sat talking to Chloe, went on a walk, went out with his sister, and I didn't do cock all. And towards the end, I was like, fuck, I kind of need to set off now. But I've not got my post ready. And I need my post ready because it's all going to fucking snowball now. Like, I'll go home and I'll have to change what I'm wearing fast, pick up. Did I say? Did I say we're going out for a meal? Did I not even tell you? Yeah, I'm sure I said we're going out with the girls. Did I not? Whatever. Me, Chloe, and Sally are going out for a little meal. Um, so I'm just going to go and get ready ASAP. There's no getting ready about it. I'm just pulling the teeth curlers out and changing my pants or whatever. But. I need to have the post ready and it's not ready and then I'm going to need to post it at 6 o'clock which will be just about the time that I get there or maybe whilst I'm driving and it's not ready and I can't be on my phone at the meal and I've had all day to do all this stuff and I'm a fucking idiot. I've wasted another day. I fucking hate myself. My phone's on low battery as well and I need full battery obviously so I can do my work. I'm a fucking prick. Oh my god. Oh, it's nice of you. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, lovely dessert. Well, that was lovely to see my dear old friends. Um, yeah, it was nice. We had a nice meal. We'll have to do it again. I just felt bad because I had to kind of. No, I didn't have to rush off. It is nearly 10 o'clock. But I just, you know, when you just keep thinking of the things that you need to do I was like this is really nice I'm having so much fun but when I get home I need to walk Carter I need to plan for tomorrow I need to do all this shit I should have been doing this today and I fucking I feel like I wasted another day I need to get my ass in gear now because Thursday what is it Thursday? Thursday Friday I can't do anything so I've already lost what day is it is it Monday I'm gonna have to thrash it the next two days if I don't get four looks done in the next two days I'm a fucking failure. Well, I'm not a failure, but I will be. Not very. Really. Yeah, I'll be disappointed in myself. <sighs> I can do it. I can do it. Good morning. I was so tired this morning. I had to peel my eyes open. I was a bit worried. Before I looked in the mirror, I was like, oh my God, if I've got conjunctivitis, because my eyes aren't opening, but I was actually just really tired. My eyes have been really itchy, which is worrying. But I feel like it's because I've been just with Carter so much um I was with Rosie and Carter yesterday so I, I'm not allergic to dogs but maybe I am a tiny bit because when I've stroked them for ages my eyes do itch a little bit anyway I spent the morning answering Instagram questions which was nice it's nice it feels like you're having a little chat it's uh yeah it was nice but now it's time the rain has stopped schnauzer and it's time to go out on a walk so let's go and I need to lock myself in. I'm not going to date tonight. I'm not because I've I've slacked now. Nice one, Jenna. I could have had Halloween done soon, but I've slacked. So I need to do two looks today, two looks tomorrow, because then I'm away on Thursday and Friday. Fucking idiot. He's really hating this. He's being so difficult walking because he doesn't like how boggy and wet this field is. You're a dog, you're supposed to love this shit. I've li I literally had to carry him the whole way down the little ginnel because well i think the stones hurt his feet he wouldn't walk any further and then now he doesn't like water so he's he's just not walking please for the love of god i have halloween makeup to do i'm just trying to last minute start out some makeup for my friend i shouldn't do this because i i just put like not that i shouldn't give makeup to my friends obviously i should I put so much on my plate all the time and it's like it takes me a while to get up here in this loft organize it 
crawl up the stairs is a big enough task and then whilst i should be doing loads of other stuff but then i'm like i've promised this person this makeup and i need to look through this stuff now and see what i could give them but i always do it and i probably shouldn't like now i need to be doing other stuff but i'm like i need to get this done because before i give all that stuff away for the giveaway i need to make sure i'm not going to give anything away that she would want so try to find something fast but yeah i just always do it i'm like oh i'll give you some makeup oh, i'll give you some makeup and then i'm just like drowning like fog's sake i don't have the time right i've just lugged all these boxes downstairs and i'm gonna i literally move the setting and everything if my mum was this you go fucking spare um i'm going to separate them into three different giveaways so this is gonna be hard because obviously i don't want one to be shit and two to be really good so i need to really separate <sighs> separate them well i'm gonna do it in categories first so i'm just gonna do like big pile of lashes big pile of palettes lip products and then just cut it all into three and see what happens right i know this doesn't look very neat but this is the best i could do in the space i had lashes eyeshadow palettes brush cleaning stuff very small pile of nails don't know where to put that and then a whole lot of random makeup i'm not thinking about that too much i'm just gonna throw it around um tan then like collaborations yeah um, and then what i consider to be big prizes full uh huda beauty well not the full thing but you know what i mean like be expensive to buy all them and then a ghd hot brush that's my biggest prize though and i don't want people to just say oh my god it's a G something ghd and just pick that one um oh well no i don't think they will um what the fuck was that that's just fallen off shouldn't i be concerned um yeah because i mean probably if you bought all these it'd probably be the same price as them but people just see ghd and they think fuck yeah uh, and then a few smells. Probably need one more perfume, really, for three giveaways. I'm going to spread it out now. I'm going to rack the floor so people don't think I'm a tramp. And then lay it out. Oh, and miscellaneous. Just random shit. I always like this little coffee cup, but I don't drink coffee. And I've never used it, so shut up. Mm, I've added in more of what I thought would be better um, things. So I've got Mermaid Waver. I have actually used this once, but I mean once like it's brand new they, they can be grateful for what they're bloody getting that's a lovely waver actually but i've already got a big waver so there's no point in me having two it's nice and pink do you know the stuff underneath it's still like unwrapped as well so fuck it that's brand new um yeah and then a ghd brush some mark hill curl heads so i just want them all to be equal oh my god so it's taken me a while but Give oh that scared me to death that ribbon. I thought it was a crack in the tile. Giveaway number one. I feel like this one looks quite big, but it's I don't know. I've been debating the sizes. Giveaway number two. Oh, does that one look no, I think they're the same size. And then giveaway number three. I think they're all kind of similar. I've been racking my brains for ages on whether one looks bigger than the other, but the there's um obviously that one's got the the waiver. That one's got the GHD. So then I, I tried to put kind of more products, little products in this one to make up for that. But then you've got the Huda Beauties. I don't know. Look. I asked Jake's mum and she was like, Jenna, they just get what they're given. Like, they're lucky to even get that. And that's a good point. But I just feel like I want it to all be right. But I think, I think I'm happy with that. I think I am. Well, today has been a fucking whirlwind. I can't believe it. I have actually showered today. I know it doesn't look like it. I've fucking not got makeup done again. I actually am. Oh, I just can't. I feel so terrible about it. I feel like I'm letting myself down every day. But I am. I am doing stuff. Like every minute of the day, I'm doing stuff to do with Halloween that needs being done. But I don't feel accomplished unless I get a look done. I've spent all day organising that giveaway, taking the pictures, sorting the pictures out, adding music, adding the numbers. Because it's like a number to give away, I suppose. And then that took me ages to post that. I've just posted tonight's look. 
I've posted the giveaway. I still need to post the transition and the... What the fuck else? Why don't I need to post? The makeup removal. I need to post my TikToks. <sighs> I am just packaging up these giveaways as well. I'm really hoping that giveaway does well. People don't really seem to care about giveaways anymore for some reason. I think people are scared because they think they don't win because some fucking influencers don't post the winner, which is very sketchy because it's like, who fucking won? You shouldn't leave people guessing. Did someone win? Did someone not win? Did I win? I think you should always post it. So yeah, I feel like people have lost a bit of faith in giveaways. Give give giveaways, but hopefully people enter mine. Just packaging it all up now separate boxes and then i need to put the kitchen back to how it was walk carter luckily i've got loads of leftovers from last night's pasta so i could just warm that up for tea because i don't have a fucking time to make tea what are we barking at i ain't even showing you this tea because to put it quite simply it looks like it's been regurgitated oh i don't think i've ever had no i have had heated up pasta but it all plopped out in the shape of the box it knocked me sick oh it's actually knocking me a bit sick right now but i haven't got time to make anything else stop it stop it you're knocking me sick you're making me feel sick i put my bedding in the washing so i've still not had a chance to make my bed but i don't mind because i've got the most beautiful memory foam mattress right and i feel like it's not at its full potential when it has the mattress cover on because you can't spring that far down into it because i feel like the the um Mattress cover, not mattress cover, what are they called? Just the normal thing that everyone has on the mattress. The mattress cover. Sheet. Yeah, I feel like it ruins the potential. So I actually quite like sleeping with no sheets on. Look at this mess that he's making on my bed. My mum would have a fit though if she came in. So I mean, she, I don't know why, she finds it horrific sleeping on bed sheets on. She'd be like, oh, I'll do them for you. You can't go to sleep like that. But I think I've made it quite nice. I've put out a little blanket for him because I really want him to sleep right next to me tonight. Even though he's making a mess. Uh, and we're cosy. I'm going to do some more editing. And then I'm going to get up really early. I'm going to try and fucking get some looks done tomorrow because otherwise I'm a failure. I'm up. I'm up. Six o'clock. Six o'clock in the morning. This is my own fault. No one's fault but my own that I've had to get up this early. Right. We're doing makeup. Sat here at seven in the fucking morning trying to work out how to make a paper bowl. It's just not. I'm so tired. I think my eyes are drying out. I didn't know why they were so itchy, but someone said they might be drying out because of the contacts. So I've put in these allergy eye drops, but they... I'm thinking, are they off? I only got them. I'm going to expire in 25. I only got them this year. Um, they hurt when they go in a little bit. But my eyes might be dried out. They feel so tired. You know when you're like, your eyes are straining because you're that tired? That's what they feel like. What the fuck is that? It's all crinkled. Mine just didn't. She was pulling it out dead easy on the video. Mine was like fucking fighting a fucking gorilla. So hard to do. What the fuck? I'm going to put a load of eyeshadow on it so it looks a bit old what the fuck is dripping out my nose like that it's like, it's like water that's weird it's not smart can it be contact juice contact se uh, selection contact i think it can you know because when i put eye blood in my eyes it comes out my nose because it goes through your tear ducts doesn't it i think i've got contact solution dropping out my nose Fucking mum just messaged me. We have a cleaner that comes every two weeks. Cleaners are coming. I'm gonna have to tidy the whole fucking thing when I'm in the middle of a look. For goodness sake. As in I'm gonna have to tidy up all the shit that's everywhere around the house. Cause, cause I'm, 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 ugh, I'm an artist. Okay, a few deliveries then. Yeah, I can't remember if I told you or not. But I'm going to this lovely event tomorrow. It's like this, um, I think it's like an, I don't, actually don't even fully know the brand. It's like an aesthetics um, Botox brand. I should really look into that. Oh God, this makeup's not going off well. Come off well. Um, yeah, and we're going for like an overnight stay. At, what's it called? It's called Mottram Hall. And 
yeah it sounds lovely so we go there uh, we have like afternoon tea and then we have spa access and we then we book in for a treatment we get a treatment done i fucking need botox i think the sunbed's fried all my botox out because i've noticed i'm un unbelievably saggy um and then we go for dinner and it's a nice little evening and then we go to bed and then we have breakfast in the morning we go home that is such a nice idea for an event so I, I haven't really got any red i've got like four red things red's never really been for me um so i say that well i'm putting on two red gat well i've got two red things on nah so i've just thought i need to really quickly order some work because i don't have anything so plt was just the easiest option because i know it comes very fast and i ordered it last night at half nine and it did, it did exactly what I thought it would. It came fast, didn't it, Shaza? So I'll try them on when I get back. Right, it's quarter past four. My posts are all ready to go for tonight. Well, I say tonight, two hours. Time to start a new makeup. I don't know if I'll get three done today. I mean, I could, but I've got a pack and plan for tomorrow. So pushing it a little bit. But I am actually in the zone today. I feel like once you've done one, you can do them all but once you stop that's it you can't finish and it's half seven so that is win do you know what well annoying <laughs> i um i said to my mom i was like please can you ask the cleaners to go anywhere but my bathroom because obviously i mean obviously every second of every day even if you tidy it up it's only going to be a mess five minutes later so there's no point in cleaning it and i have left up everywhere anyway there's lashes there's contacts there's teeth it's just it's my haven at the minute and then um she's like yeah yeah and then i hear some noise upstairs i th i'd thrown everything in here off the landing as well just and i'd shut the door just so it was tidy for them they had you know space or whatever and they didn't see my mess i heard the bath running I thought, well there's only one bath and it's my in my bathroom i go up and they're in here cleaning and i'm like no 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 you're not supposed to come in here <laughs> and starting moving my stuff and stuff like that um and then my abby roberts under lashes they were on here and i think they've been binned now they didn't clean the full thing out i came up luckily like five minutes after they've been in there but i was like there's literally no point cleaning because it's going to be dirty in the next hour anyway just just leave this room they my mum had told them she, they just thought that she'd forgot to say to do this room um yeah, my Abby Roberts lashes are in the bin. I don't know where they are. Well, they've got to be in the bin. I know they just look like little spiders on the side and they look like for the bin. But they were there. They were there where I knew where they were. Don't you just hate when people move your stuff? I'm, no hate, look. No, no hate to them. They're doing the job. But I just... I needed them lashes. And I haven't got another pair of them. So I've had to cut off a pair of my lashes. But it's just not the same. It's like when your mum comes in your room and starts moving all your stuff around and it sends you into fucking overdrive. Where are my lashes? Put my Abby Roberts lashes in the bin. Oh, I'm so tired. It's half nine. I'm, I'm so glad I got two looks done today. I feel accomplished for the first time this week. I'm just, thank God for Granny and Grandad. I've just dropped off Carter, but I've, it's half nine. I've not had my tea. I've not packed. I've not tried on any of the clothes. I've not washed my hair. My eyes are hurting. You feel like they're you know, you're that tired. Well, they felt like that all day, actually, haven't they? So that's great. The minute I woke up to the minute... I'm not even going to sleep for ages. Oh, it's never too late to make good food. Morning. I got my hair washed. I got my tea made. I tidied up a bit. I didn't try on any of this stuff. I thought I was a step too far. I got to bed by one. Got up at eight and surprisingly I feel I feel relatively well rested and quite pleased. I'm just gonna get my pulse ready for tonight and then we're gonna get up. I'm I'm, I'm quite excited for today. I'm gonna get up and um sort my shit out for tonight. Well today, tomorrow. I'm absolutely pissing it down anyway, so I'm so glad I don't have to walk Carter today. Look, I've taken the... Did I tell you? Probably already said, didn't I? 
I was thinking, why is this makeup still on my face? I had two lines there. I've taken the skin off my fucking face because I pulled that rigid, I had this rigid clothing on my face. It's like to create scars. It's basically like a chemically liquid. You put it on and it's it goes really tight and squeezes your skin together. And it makes it look like a scar, but I pulled it off by my mouth. It was so stuck down. And it's ripped my skin off. It's not sore, but I mean, it's not great, is it? I've had to start sleeping in Carmex again. I feel alright, you know. Fuck it. I think the first outfit from my PLT order that I've tried on is a win. It's a bit dry. Oh, you can't fucking really see this. Right, so it's like red sling back kind of heels this bag which i thought was really cool it looks like a really good fake leather as well it really looks like leather like look at that it feels really nice and then how cool are the spikes super emo and then this oh very long it's like one of those body print dresses and then the shoes i thought that they're cool maybe hold the bag down here I love that one, try some. I it's a bit daring. I have been eating what I want this Halloween and I'm not exactly what I want, but I've been being a bit daring and not going to the gym. So I don't really like that it's very figure hugging, but it's PLT shape. Now I know that's what is it even that far? Is it for people with just like mad curves? I don't know, but I ordered it anyway, because I've ordered from shape before and it's not really been much different, but it's just mega like sucky so it's quite good actually just normal people well not normal people you know what i mean you unshaped like person ouch it's a win for me it's a win have you ever seen such a dramatic shoe box in your life <laughs> what is the need i feel like that doesn't even look as big as it is but it's fucking huge it's like three of my hair it's for the these giant boots like just fold them up and put them in a normal box. It's not that hard, is it? We're going to a spa. I thought I don't want to wear a bikini at the minute because mm, I'm not feeling great. So I've got this swimsuit. I thought it was quite cool, but they only had a four left. So I ordered a four. I thought I'll just try it. It's like, it's giving me some, some shape. Give me some shape though, because it's like sucking in there. But I mean... Sorry, this is a bit graphic. It's not that deep, but it's... Today calls for a brow tint. It's gonna be my first... Fucking hell. First glam, proper glam. With red hair. I wanna look nice. To be honest, they were kind of dark anyway. Do you know what? I think this red dye, I think it darkened them because I don't see why they would still be quite tinted. I haven't tinted them in ages. And my root looks, I don't know if it's compared to the red or what, but my root looks a really funny colour. I think I've dyed my root. I think I have. I mean, it makes sense. It would definitely change the colour of it. Um, I just thought my hair would look really shit. Because I hate, I hate a light root with dark hair. Unless it's like, so like when I did white roots with pink hair, but like, say like, when someone has blonde hair naturally and they have black hair, it looks like you're balding. So I really didn't want, because I've got blonde hair, I didn't want my roots to come through and be so much lighter than my hair and it just look ter terrible. But it actually doesn't because I think, yeah, I think it's dyed my roots. So it kind of looks like a dark root, which I'm so glad about. Oh, what a lovely little parcel to send me because they know that I do my Halloween makeup removals. He sent me, just, just stocked me up. Said to Jenna. So you are fully stocked up when removing your amazing Halloween looks. I think that's so sweet. I mean, <laughs> even if it is so, I'll promote the products. That is, that's, that's thoughtful. Oh my God, how cute is this? <laughs> Loads of little mini powder puffs and like little heart shapes. They're so cute. Oh, what color? Cherry blossom cake, sick. And cupcake. I didn't have anything appropriate to wear. I'm like, what do you wear for afternoon tea? Really? 
just because well no i know what you wear for afternoon tea but i don't have anything sensible to arrive in i don't have anything red so i thought i'll raid mum's wardrobe because if there's someone that loves red it's my fucking mum and i found it i found this jumper so i've tucked it under a little bit i think it looks kind of cool with the gazelles as well i think it's quite cute i think that's a perfect afternoon tea vibe well <laughs> probably it's my version of perfect for afternoon tea my eyebrows are huge slugs it's like they're actually a bit too big that right one is offending me seriously but when i take out these heatless curls hopefully i might look half decent hey get back up there you i need to go to the gym <laughs> Oh, finally time to take out the heatless curly whirlies. This is honestly just my favourite part of the day because I feel, I don't feel like painfully ugly with it in, but it does affect my mood. Uh, I mean, to be honest, I look fucking ugly all the time. Like, I look scruffy 90% of the time. But yeah, I just love taking this out so much. It makes me so happy. Because I feel like once you have beautiful hair, you just can't, you can't complain about anything. Come on, let's see how you turn down. Oh, what the fuck? It actually doesn't look that good today. <gasps> it's because it's still wet. Oh my God. Oh my God, Jenna. I went, I went to bed with it too wet for once. I've never done that before. I've never done that before. Oh my God. It's gone like wrinkly. That's not cool. Wow, that's really not cool. I'll have to dry it and put it back in and hope that it goes in the car. What the fuck? Finally time to start off. I'm actually, yeah, I'm really keen for today. I think it's gonna be really nice. So, and I really need some fucking Botox. But I've already, I've seen on their page, they do this like, no, I'm not saying I will, but this like buccal, is it called buccal fat removal? And it, and it makes you look a bit like, caves in there, but it looks very timber and I know it's not supposed to, but I love it. I love it. I love it that I look sick shouldn't mess about with stuff like that but that would be so cool my forehead's in the no in the most need though at the minute um but it does look pretty good <laughs> oh my god i have this dental brand as well that want to make me my own they asked me last year but i was working with fucking sale dental not anymore um and yeah they want to make me my own fangs made, made out of composite like to perfectly fit my teeth Fuck yes, yeah. so I messaged them again. I reached back out this year. I was like, I know you said you wanted to do this last year, but I'd really like to do it this year. I'm not working with any dentists. Um, and they said, yeah. So I could be walking around with concave cheeks and fangs. A real life Tim Burton character. Oh wait, well yeah. Do you know what? I'd actually like them on my own teeth. I'd love fangs. I'd love spines down my back. A little dragon tail, maybe some horns. It changes all the time. Bunny, no, a bunny tail, dragon horns, spine. I'd love spines down my back so much. That would be so cool. Fines. It's a good job I'm not in charge. It's a fucking good job. Picked up this idiot. What the fuck are you doing? I really hope this is fine now. I don't think it will be. You know. I don't think it will be. Fuck off. Come on, give me something to be happy about. Stunning. Looks all right to me. Suck farts, Lucy Hart. Shut up, fatty. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Isn't that fatty? <laughs> Probably the funniest thing you've ever said. Success. It worked. They're like a lady of leisure now. It's lovely. Very nice. We're about 10 minutes late now, but it'll do. How cute is this? It's so nice in here. Look at this room. So nice. And then look outside. What? This would be a sick place to get married. It's beautiful. Um, we are really, really 
excited to have you all to hear, um, all here today. Our style and that it works around you, and especially as women are growing, we emphasise a lot at the moment as well with perimenopause and menopausal changes. That was nice. I'm not old enough for um, afternoon tea though, so I'm still starving because I, I forced myself to eat a ham and pick a lily. I've never had pick a lily in my life. I didn't know what it was. Oh, I couldn't okay. taste it loads, but... Is that... Uh... We're just finding our rooms now. Um, we've got these little gift bags though. We've got, we've got a couple. Oh, we've got there. Oh, just... this is me. Okay. We just booked in massages. Brilliant. Mine is at half five at the back massage. I actually wanted a full body one, but she only had time for 20 minute treatments. So I'm getting a back massage. Lucy's getting a back massage as well. But tomorrow, tomorrow morning, because they didn't have any. Oh, it's like, it's like your own little pod. No, I'm getting in the nude. Oh, this, right, let me in, let me in, let me in. The other one's closed. The other one's closed. And the Cozy. I can't get my hair wet though. God. If it starts raining, we're fucked. Look at them baby hairs. They're stupid. Like bits of felt we get from the craft shop. <laughs> Flamingo feathers. Carrot feathers, not flamingo. Right, I've got my consultation now. For potentially Botox or filler or just whatever we have in mind. He's going to help me. Through the glass doors. Through the glass doors. Through the glass doors. If you don't get it, then fuck off. So you can book in, um, and then we can look after you. I love the spa music when you're about to stab so me with needles. So I'm getting, what am I getting? You're it's getting, like baby Botox kind of thing. So you are getting a skin booster. Yeah. And um, yeah, you've got to get a little bit of baby Botox in there. A few drops. A few little drops. And then afterwards, um, once you've opened your treatments, I'll do like a little um, testimonial of you both, if that's okay. Yep. What does the tapping do? It's just like a pain transfer thing. So oh, it just kind of so like yeah. makes you distract and also I, I like it though. I tap your lip onto the needle instead of putting the needle into the lip. That makes sense. Clever. Change of plan. So you can't have um, massage after it because you'll be lying down. Then you need to be upright for at least four hours. So I'm doing massage now, then the Botox. I'm sleepy now. I asked her to go hard and she went hard. She did a good job. <sighs> now I have to get stabbed. Indeed I was. Yes, I, did I even tell you? I've got brain issues, me. I do not know. Um, getting a skin booster with a little bit of baby Botox in my forehead. We're going to lift up my brows a bit as well. And a B12. My first B12, which I'm excited about because Lucy goes on about them. I've always wanted one. Well, this morning we've had Paris Fury's been here with a new baby, and Lucy's just alerted me that I feel like I've got Jocko button there. Uh, she's alerted me that apparently Tommy Fury's in the pool. Should we go and have a nosy? We're just waiting, waiting to be numbed up. <laughs> Show me what you did again when Tommy Fury was in the pool, please. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, look at my Oh yeah, she's had a lip on you've had a lip flip. No. Oh, I thought you had a lip flip. No, he doesn't do that, does he? That's both of us. I've had filler. Oh, sorry, bro. You saw it happen. Yeah, I didn't listen to what I was doing though. I'm not an aesthetician. I've loads. What have you had? What have you had done? What? Loads on your lips. Oh, have you you've just had your lips though. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Coming back for more. Yeah, it's fine. Good. We're just sat like two slabs of meat, and <laughs> Tommy Fury's over there with all his posse. Can we show and it, them? And it, them no, slabs. how how can I do that? Show it. I feel so I feel like every time I look up, I just want to know, dear, just because I'm such a like. I get really starstruck. Me, I'm like, oh my god. But um, every time I look over, it's almost like. I don't know, it's just, it just doesn't work. I, all I want is an Ozzy. Hang on, she said before, it's like, you know, when there's like two teenage girls in a film. Trying yeah, to that's what we feel like. That's what we're like. We'll 
I'm not, I'm not, I'm not like trying to like, you know, eye him up. I just literally just want to, you know, when you see someone in person and you used to see, I just want to observe. Um, it's very eyeball anyway, isn't it? Yeah, fun. it's like you were all, everyone's like staring at each other, but like on, or like wild child or something, or some sort of chick flick, when you can see them like popping up behind a bin to look at, so I feel like that. I feel like we're peacocking. We're both here inconspicuous, like she, I'm well, not, you might be. She, her phone's dead and she's been pretending to be on a phone. <laughs> <laughs> we need to go and get ready. I filmed, well, I didn't film much pain Certainly with that. Why? No, no, I can't, I can't. Fucking me that again. She said, I feel like I'm even walking <laughs> weird. I know what you mean, do the walk. <laughs> what is that about though? What is that about? It's like, it's not, like, it's, I don't know. It's just, it's just, I don't know. I feel like I just want to go up, I just want to go up to him and knock on and just be like, I love Molly. Can you just tell her that I love her? And also, can you tell her, please don't discontinue the old tiny mitts because she's getting rid of the elasticated ones and they're her favourite ones. So if you could just pass on the message, that would be brilliant. But I just don't know if he'll pass on the message is my problem. Imagine if I just went in there. Excuse me, Tommy. Could you please let Molly know that I really like the elasticated mitts um, and not to change them. Thank you so much. To now, you can have a quick glance now and I'll make it look like nothing's happening, but that was it. That was the bossy. That was kind of inconspicuous, do you not think? Ooh, apparently this is where Tommy stays. This is the, the special place. It's got a little chimney. <laughs> oh, I'm starving, me, you know. I'm not the sort of person that can eat. I'm not eating all day. I can't. And I'm not a afternoon tea girl. I braved it with two little ham and piccalilli sandwich fingers and a wee little cake. Honestly, if I could regurgitate them, I would. It weren't worth it. I just want a toasty mate or, or spaghetti. But we've pre-ordered our tea, haven't we? So I can't remember what we're having, but I'm hoping that... I'm pretty sure I picked the best things on the menu, so... It's like a little surprise when you pre-order your own. Um... She keeps saying it's a dream car, but it's it's just the most basic dream car. It's, it's what most people want. It's just a G-Wagon. She's like, she says, it's my dream car. Like, it's going to be this outrageous, like, special edition, you know, whatever. And, it, and you just turn around and it's just a G-Wagon. basic Yeah, but there's no point saying, this is my dream car right here. It's everyone's dream car. Oh, that's nice for baby girls like me. Oh, needs a bit of a refurb in there, but um, nice. Yeah. Ready? Yeah. Yeah. Actually, I had to use heat on my hair because there was no time to heat this curl. Oh yeah. And how much time did you? Have? You were late. <laughs> Do it. For what you? What you learn? Lucy keeps saying I'm gonna get us in trouble. Why am I? I'm not gonna get us in trouble. We actually forgot what we ordered and then it's quickly checked. I've never been so pleased with news in my life. Uh, yeah, it's 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 oh yes. I'm so glad that I don't have food envy because look how good mine looks. I don't have it. <laughs> what is that? Golden syrup tart? Mine looks good. I didn't really get to show you my outfit piece together. Well I showed you this morning but I like it. Why do the walls look like they've been scrubbed? And there was blood on there previously. There's quite a few of them. I'm a bit concerned. Everyone seems to be like dropping throughout the night with different illnesses. What just happened to me? Yeah, Lucy just went really faint. I've had pains in my stomach loads, but no, I am. Black. I completely blacked out at the dinner table. Completely no, blacked out. Me, this, me in my head, like my eye went blurry, and I was like, oh fuck, I need to. Stop touching my rectum. <laughs> Gee, oh yeah, your hand just accidentally brushed past my arse today. It's over here, babe. It's this way, babe. <laughs> you need putting down, you. Yes, it is. Yeah, we, we got in the lift. We got in the lift. I don't know. I don't know. I just, I just go the way that I came. Anyway. Stomach pains, but I have got big Bridget Jones stickers on, so I'm thinking maybe they're squishing my organs. And we are different then. 
Are we not? No, I think it's my Bridget Jones necklace. No, I'm starting to feel like we've been brought here to be secretly murdered. That is bad lighting. <gasps> it's good lighting. <laughs> oh, holy dog shit. Good morning. No, oh, where's that thing would go? Um, I had a really nice day yesterday. I've woke up before my alarm, which is fantastic. And Lucy's like, I've gone for breakfast. Come down, please. No, fuck that. I don't eat breakfast. Well, I don't eat breakfast until some stupid time. And yeah, I just don't want it. She said, are you coming to the spa? I just kind of just want to stay here until I have to leave. But that hot tub was actually quite nice yesterday, so I think I'll join her in the hot tub. I've never have a sensible browse on my phone. Ooh, hot tub for one then. How the fuck do you do this? No, massage my back. I just turn it on. Yeah, yeah, baby. Oh, I don't believe this. Oh, you're having a laugh. <laughs> I don't believe this. She's just been having breakfast with Harry Styles' mom. Mm-hmm. Should have got up and got breakfast and should have got that. Not a loser, but if you just said I would have come on that. Oh, hi girls, I'm actually in the mood for a croissant now. No <laughs> uh, Live on Toto, yeah. Brilliant, brilliant. One more ticket, please. Oh, I can't wait to see the next one. I'm fuming. How's the Botox? Not good. Not good. <laughs> I can't believe fucking it. I'm sorry, I've just been in the steam room, so like a lobster. I can't believe fucking Harry Styles' mum was there the whole time. I didn't even realise. Probably spoke to her and I didn't even realise. What the fuck is that? Why is this some sort of like celebrity breeding ground? Where even are we? Mock from home, Cheshire. I'll be back. Ross Geller, who? Well, that was nice. That was lovely. That was a nice little reset. My back still feels fucked even though I've had a massage. I suppose it'll never feel any different. Um, yeah, so, just dropped off Lisa, I'm gonna go and pick up my little schnauzer, taking my grandma and granddad to the doctors, and I'll bring schnauzer home, and I want to get a makeup look done today. My dad's coming home, he's been working away, thank God, I'm not saying in ages, actually, I, a lot of the times I don't miss him, but I actually have missed him, um, so it'd be nice to see him, hopefully we don't argue, and, yeah, so I'll sell make tea, Halloween lot, make tea. Yeah, I'm just gonna try, try and do as many Halloween looks as I can this weekend. But I've also got Christmas jumps to film for Soap and Glory, which is... I wish I could just film them in a couple weeks when I'm done with Halloween and I can have a fresh mind, but they've got to be done this weekend, so... Halloween and Christmas at the same time. And what I'm thinking is, I have a bit of a crazy plan in mind. Um, I really want to go away this, this December, this winter. I mean it was so nice when we went to Paris last year but I don't think Jake can afford it this year but I really want to go but and then I just think do you know what why don't I just treat us a little tiny bit thinking do you know what I'm bored of just saying like let's do it let's do it I can't wait to do it let's actually do it so I'm thinking I'm just gonna book something I'll book it, give me Jake's Christmas and birthday present. But I've got big plans. I really, really, and I know he'll, he will never watch this, so we're safe to talk about it. I want to go to New York. And I'm just trying to gauge at the minute, because I've only come up with this idea in the past two days. I'm trying to gauge, because my friend Sally, when I went to see her, she's... That's a secret too. No, this will be, won't be edited, so it should be fucking gone and come back by the time I've edited this. She's going to New York, and I was talking to her, and I was like, I want to go to New York. I was just thinking, thinking, why not just do it? Just do it, you know, I work hard. Let's just fucking do it. I'm sick of saying, oh, I can't wait to do this. One day we'll do that. Let's do it now. I'm gonna only be young once, and then when I have a house, all my money will be sucked off. Sucked up! <laughs> sucked away by that. Um, yeah, so I'm trying to potentially plan that. So it's a lot of money, but I mean, get one life if you want to do it just fucking do it i'm not going to do it every month am i so yeah that's currently what's going on in my brain thinking about do you know what all i'm worried about is people saying oh say like if it was like my mum and dad or jake saying oh 
well it's too much like you shouldn't have done that or oh you should be saving for your house or you should be doing this but I, yeah, I am saving for my house so just let me do it I, i'm too wor worried about all the what other people will think to be honest i'm just like i want to go i want to go <laughs> I just want to do it. I just want to do it. Ew. I'm just driving through the scruffiest place. I saw this guy open his window and just drop this cup out onto the floor. How, how can you even be raised to think that's okay? I just beat my horn and I just went, as I drop off, I went, <laughs> and he just went, no, wait, wrong finger. He went, <laughs> what the fuck? The world is not your bin. Oh, vile person. He thinks it's an intruder. Hi! Hello! Hello! <laughs> Hello, pumpkin! Show me, what have you got? He's beautiful. Whoa, they're good. I love them. What have you? Mm? You're smelling them. What have you? What have you? There's terminal openers. Whoa, love opening my terminal. Yeah, I uh, didn't do any makeup. I'm I'm gonna tidy my room and edit some vlog stuff because I think it's too late and I'm just gonna organise all my videos ready for tomorrow and I'm gonna get up at six and do as many as I can. Fucking Jake's Jake's marginally slightly annoyed me. He's um asked if I wanna walk up scaffold pie today. He know he knows that I'm stressed and I'm busy with this. And I'm like locking myself, obviously apart from yesterday, but pretty much locking myself in. Apart from some exceptions until I'm done. Why ask me that? Oh yeah, I'm free to walk up a fucking mountain or whatever it is. No, you know I'm busy and stressed. And I don't like missing out. So now I just feel like I'm missing out. Why do you ask me that? Why can we not just do it another time when I can do it? This place just looks horrible. I've had no sheets on for days. But it's... What, there's a, a suitcase from my trip over a month ago. I just wanted... Where are all my plants? Where are all my plants? Where's everything? What's going on? I just want it to be nice and cosy, so we're going to do that. We're going to do that now, so I can work in peace. Obviously, I got sidetracked. Guess what I've started? That's right. This is everything that's up so far. It's a lot. <sighs> Thank fuck for that I mean there's still some mess and this all this still needs to go up there's probably more <laughs> it's so much but I've got clean sheets on it's one in the morning I did this is this isn't right I can't I can't I can't do anything I can never do anything to plan this job needs two people I can't do this on my own anymore <laughs> I can't I need Jake to to quit and help me because I just can't. Oh, I've just spotted another fucking pink thing. Fuck off, make your case. Fuck off. Oh god. Right, I'm. I feel a bit better though because that needed doing that job. So, well done. Oh, I've also cleared out a lot of my bags. Wow. Looks so much neater. I actually, I really don't have a lot of red stuff though. Obviously, apart from the stuff that I bought recently. But I feel like when I changed to pink. I, Oh, did I? Maybe I've just forgot what it's like to change colours. Fuck, they need selling their hideous. Yeah. I probably shouldn't have stayed up under that last night because now I'm so tired. I set my alarm for seven, but I, I literally, I woke up, you know when you wake up five minutes before your alarm, and I thought it was the middle of the night. I was like, oh, it's just the middle of the night, like. Obviously, I'm exhausted now, but when my alarm goes off, I'll be fine. I checked my phone. I had five minutes left. I was like, I can't. So it's nine o'clock. I've lost two hours. And I've just woke up to loads of messages of people offering me, like, two pound less than what I've put it up for. I'm just like, no. If you, if you want it, go and get it off the fucking website then, because everything's already well cheap. I just think it's two pound. I'm not going to the shop just to fucking post you that. What's the point? You buy it off the website only worn once in pretty much fucking immaculate condition. You see how much it is then? Currently out stealing clips 
of ivy from the garden because I didn't want to order fake ivy. One, because I'm a menace, and two, because I didn't want to order fake ivy because it, it looks too green and too fake. So I wanted the real thing. So I'm probably gonna have fleas by the end of the day. I went a bit wild last night. I started ordering Carter some new colors and Halloween jumpers. Got this spiked color, you know, like a classic spiked color. It's so cool, the color's not here yet. But uh, two of his jumpers have just come. Let's have a look. It's so cute. It fits. It fits, doesn't it? It's so awkward though. I'll just stand there like that now because he didn't like it. And I got him some pumpkin one as well. I just think it looks really nice with the black fur. Oh, look at that! And you! <gasps> Pretty boy! I, I fucking love this one. I'm actually going to show you because do you know what? It's fucking stupid because I'll never get these locked up before I even post any of these probably so i am stupid but whoop, it's poison ivy i never wanted to do poison ivy before i never thought it was a good look i just thought it's not really anything is it like who is she she's what is she some sort of villain it's just doesn't oh jake's ringing me yeah i never had any interest in doing her um but i thought i can't not with red hair um and i quite liked it but then i put in these scary eyes because the original plan was i'm just gonna put red contacts in because, you know, she's not a monster. She, I don't know. She's just a woman. So I was just going to do red eyes. It's a bit scary. My red eyes, I put them in. They were so fucked. Like, they're all blurry and scratched. So I'll have to bin them. Um, so then I was looking for another pair of red eyes. And I found these. I thought they were normal size lenses. And then I opened them. They were scleras. And I thought, you know what? I'll try it. Because I do love a sclera. I think they make the look, look so much more scary and different. And I, I really like them. I think they've taken it to the next level. I'd like to do a, um, a Halloween where I wear all big lenses because they are just my favourite. And not a lot of other people do it. Don't do it if you're watching this. Only me. Uh, yeah. They really saw these though. I don't know why. They're brand new. They just come out of the box. They're just really uncomfortable to wear. Usually, usually they are pretty comfy. My black ones, I could wear them all day, but... I nearly had to take them out, but I was like, no, Jenny, you have to suffer. The leaves look good, though. Sent my dad out on a dog walk to get them. It is three o'clock. Uh, I am going to start another one, but I'm not exactly where I want it to be. I want to get three done today. If I'd gone up at six, I might have had the chance, but I don't think I will now. I'll try. I'll try. It's time to wash it off anyway. You can tell I'm running out of energy when I start making this for tea. Six o'clock. It's time to... Oh, sorry pure fucking mascara bogeys going on um it's time to start another one at six o'clock i have to do another one i have to i have to i wanted to do three today but it's just it's just not feasible um yeah i've not seen jake in days i think i've not seen him in like four days which is a bit crazy for us so i'm really gonna try and get this done in um, three and a half hours would be sensible but i don't know I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Shouldn't take me that long, but every time I say that, it does take me that long. I'm done, I'm done. 18 looks, 18 looks down. I'm not going to Jerry's, it's a bit too late. It's like half ten. There's just no point, is there? I've got stuff that I need to do, I need to whatever anyway, so. Ugh. Coated my face in my skin food again. Thank God for that. It's the most thick thing you can possibly put on your skin ever. I think my Botox is kicking in already as well. Wait. Oh my God. My eyebrows are going up so high. They basically, he told me because I wanted a brow lift. He put most of it in the center here. Because I think something to do with like... It relaxes your muscles here, so these ones have to work harder. So I'm guessing that's why my eyebrows are going so high up at the sides. And I'm guessing that encourages the brow lift. I'm guessing that used to be. I'm just guessing a lot, Anna. I'm just guessing, guessing, guessing. My alarm. It's about half six. It's currently eight o'clock. So tired. So tired. Right. So, four Christmas jobs, one which requires a clean bathroom. And hopefully, I don't think I'll get Halloween look done, but I can, 
I can, uh, I can try. <sighs> Let's get up. Oh, fucking hell, I need to send now I'm in to baths as well. Oh, let's get up. This is gonna be really fun. Really fun. Yeah, I do actually like tidying, but I'm tired. Well, I've been working very, very hard all day. I've I've literally done so much. I've, I've done all my vintage stuff. I've tidied everything. I've organised stuff. I have cleaned to the into oblivion. Um, I'm just ready to film my Christmas jobs and I've hit a hurdle. I've gone to read through the brief before I do it. The brief has expired. They sent, a, usually they'll send like a PDF so you can save it, but they sent a link to WeTransfer. So I should have saved it really, but usually you just tap on it and it saves to WeTransfer. So I thought, oh, I'll just go on the original email. Link expired, link expired. So I can't view the brief. I tried to send out an urgent email. Um, tried to contact Zoe. I feel so bad messaging her on a day off. Um, but yeah, no answer so far, so I don't know what to do. Fucked up there a bit. Well, it happens. Uh, I might just have to get up. Hope that they reply early morning. Early morning. Has my, has Carter just been walking down the street? My dad just lets him sit at the top of the drive and wonders why he walks off. Has he just walked off? Why was you carrying him down from up the street then? He walked off, didn't he? He's gonna get run over. Yeah, it's not great. So, and it needed to be done for tomorrow. Uh, I'm thinking, I just do my Halloween look now and then. I've got an appointment, a dentist appointment in the middle of the day tomorrow anyway, so at one o'clock, so probably makes sense to do it tomorrow so then I can do that in the morning. Fucking hell. 24 parcels sent. Glad that's out of my hair. 24 fucking hell. There's a big queue behind me. Don't think the guy behind me was dead, please. He had one parcel. Sorry. Um. Right, I'm going to Jake's now. I've not seen Jake in fucking, I think, nearly a week. No, maybe like four days. That's nearly a week to me. He's making some nice tea. I don't know what the fuck it is. Some wild sounding stew. I don't know. Uh, he seems quite pleased with it, so we'll see. I need to get to Jake's ASAP and post my look as well because it's nearly half six. I'm so supposed to everything at six. What? Oh, what is it? Mongolian beef stew. Oh, God, it just hissed at me. Mongolian beef stew. It hissed at you. Yeah, it hissed at me. Is that what, <laughs> is that what Mongolian hissed? stew does? It hissed. Oh, obviously likes you. That looks good. Right. It's half nine and I'm so tired, but I'm just gonna have to force myself, get up and force myself to do this. I'm proud of everything I've done today. I feel like I've really organised and tidied and cleaned and whatever, but I need to, if I really want to finish by the end of next week, I need to thrash it. How many have I got left? I think 13. That's doable. I mean, I have got a few appointments next week, so it's going to be hard. But if I really pull my finger out my ass now, I can do it. I've got to do this for future me. I'm so tired and I really don't want to, but I'm doing it for me. Oh, and also, this makeup's due for tomorrow. I actually forgot about that. So I have to do it. Uh, this one is for Anyway Cosmetics. Um, it's going to be a struggle school, which is actually not too difficult. There's no brow blocking etc i actually did this same look when i went to mars the label the other day but i had to do it kind of fast um so maybe not as detailed as i would normally do it so but it didn't take me too long so i'm really hoping and praying i know i'm doing a lot of filming now but i'm praying that it won't take me that long it's 10 to 2 in the morning it took a bit longer than i thought but i'm done i'm gonna show you because i fucking love it i think it's dead cool I like the little hat, the flowers. Oh, the neck tattoos. Do you remember the shrine neck tattoos? The Sophie Lloyd ones. Sick. I wish they'd bring those back because they are really cool. And I just want a tattoo, but I don't want it for ages. I just want it for like five years. If they stayed on for five years, sick. Sick. Right, well, it's 20 past three. 
Who goes to bed at 20 past 3 on a Sunday? For fuck's sake. I hope everyone's had a lovely week. And I'll see you next week. And I, last week will be the last week. I swear to God. It'll be the last week left next week. Okay? <laughs>